the hallway over here to work. That's not bad. This, man, right in the middle of a, uh, right in the middle of our line. Let's see. All right, so we should be able to get quite a bit more. This is at home. I mean, it's just right next to us. So, put that away. Since that's our catch-all at the end, I always want to make sure that we're not getting anything else in there. All right, so let's look in here. What do we have? Garnet sand. Okay, that can go in there. Uh, diotomite and asbestos. Yep, asbestos, diotomite, asbestos. So that's all castorite. So that'll be tin. Some blood. Nice. All right, over here like we finished that up so let's drop Not fantastical amounts, but pretty good amounts, considering now we can go one for one on the plates. So, there's that.
thing just filling up. Loving it. Wish they had the ground trap one. Kind of makes me wonder should not wonder it says specifically on it fish catcher jumping creeper because you know yeah why not right Okay, so we're not going to be able to use those for that. Not a big deal. We'll stu still keep the rubber producing so that we can use the rubber. Let's go back with the... Uh, do this eight of these real quick. I like that. I like that we're there. So the next... Our next one is going to be the wiring mill, right? So that's four motors, two circuits, okay, ten cables, and the LV machine. Casing is going to be steel plates. Man, I'm telling you, one for one, much better. Much better. Liking that. All right, so the LV casing is my wrench. We're going to need a lot of those. So you know what we're going to do? We're going to grab this. I'm going to put it in here. I didn't have that anywhere else, did I? All right, so LV machine casing, good. LV machine hull is wrought iron, tin, steel, and the casing. Wrought iron. I got some iron ore. This is a lot quieter.
going to need quite a bit of tin. I'm not quite sure how much. So I don't know if I should run these through again. We're making the wire wheel. I mean, the wire mill. That's our goal, right? So... Yeah. It's night out. We should sleep. That way it doesn't rain on us, because that kind of sucks when it rains on us. So now I can make machine casings and the LV machine hull in this one. That's good. All right. So we need to make the wire mill. We need a machine hull, two tin cables, four motors, and two of our electronic circuits.
Stefan. It's I, I it's going better. I I like I like the uh, rolling machine. Rolling machine's pretty cool because it's a one for one deal. So figures put the wrong one up there. Boom. Need a copper plate? Got a copper plate. I, I started, yeah, uh, not really got too far on it, but I started working towards real cool stuff. Took a, uh, took a lot of the people's advice. That goes there, that goes there. Uh, took a lot of people of the people's advice and started working on uh, making my, getting stuff like circuits and that stuff in the workbenches that, so that it can, you know, So that all I have to do is just, you know, work a little bit at a time instead of trying to do it all at once. How are you doing today? When does school start back up for you? Or are you just done and I missed it? So I've been saying I really like that rolling machine and the wire mill's gonna be great too. Excuse me. And the wire mill is going to be great too, I bet. So, right, because once you get in, you've never really felt it. It, it, okay. So for me, I like it, but I think I like it because all I have to do is stuff stuff in it, and presto. I've got that goes there, that goes there, that goes there, that goes there. Presto, I get stuff. So I want to make wires. As long as I've got the plates here, I can make the wires here. I want to make, uh, what was I working on? Sorry, lost my train of thought. I want to make uh, steel rods or steel rings, small gears. I want to make, you know, whatever I need to make, I can program this in essence, to make it. So, like, I know I'm going to need a lot of LV machine hulls, right? So just program this one to make all the LV machine hulls. And then work my way up. This one is programmed to make the pieces to the circuits that I need. So. Ah, yeah. I hear you. I get that. And it's not like there's a whole lot of new games coming out, so it's not like you can just go, hey, I'm going to try this new game. I'm saving these up. I was going to do more of that. And there's only so much you can do before 
you can't do anymore, right? It's how it works. You can only get so far before you have to back off. Uh, I'm going to run all those three. All right. So, basic wire mill requires electric motors. Electric motors requires that. So let's make two of these to make two of these. Okay, we're going to use those in a minute. And I need one, two, three, four of those per motor. Per motor. So that's two motors. I need four motors. All right, so four of those, which means I need another six of these. Oh, I get that. I get that. Well, and and so I get what you're saying. You don't want to spend money on games so that you have it for other stuff. But there's so many different modded Minecraft that you could be playing that you could probably go to some modded Minecraft, right? Okay, so we're going to need, for four motors, I'm going to need eight tin cables. For four motors, I'm going to need four times four, 16. All right, I didn't actually see what you said. Oh, <laughs> Streamlabs being my mod right now. Um, seven messages. Holy crap! That was rude. I did. I I apologize. I'll have to change that in the settings. We need rubber sheets. That thing is still loud. We have 60, 120, 180, okay. So you don't worry about school because one, your grades are pretty much set for the year already. Okay. Man, that's actually kind of nice. Two, you're patient. Got that. Two more tin cables. And then I need two more integrated circuits. Oh, and that's it. There were only two. Okay. Um, I'll be right back. 